We finally had a chance to dry things out this weekend after all that rain last week. So it was just gorgeous for those outdoor activities for fall Greenville, picking apples, picking up pumpkins, what have you. Just beautiful. And guess what? That gorgeous weather continues today. 82 downtown Greenville. That's several degrees above the average, which is 75. Lots of lower 80s, 79 Spartanburg, 79 in Nashville, Franklin. I think your sensor is broken. It was not 56 degrees. Looking outside right now, mainly clear skies. Traffic moving along I-85 just fine. I think through the overnight, those clouds will increase a little bit. And still pretty pleasant out there. 71 downtown Greenville, 66 in Lawrence, Hartwell 67, Brevard, you're at 63, and Asheville at 64. Now tomorrow, I think, will be above average. Normally 75 for the upstate. I'm thinking around 78. For the mountains, your normal high is 71. I'm thinking about 74 for you and temperatures only warm up as we go through the upcoming week. Fox radar 3D not showing anything going on right now, mainly clear skies as we have high pressure all the way from the northeast into the mid-Atlantic into the south and east as well. And thank goodness that we are not farther to the west because they are looking at some nasty weather across the central plains, courtesy of low pressure and a strong cold front. Lots of energy diving out of the Colorado Rockies and look at at this nasty line of showers and storms, tornado warnings around Oklahoma City, down into the Dallas area. So they're looking at a very bumpy night. The good news is with this front, as it moves to the east, it will fizzle out before it gets to us. Future cast rain and clouds as we go through the overnight. By 1 a.m., you can see some of these clouds building in. So I think we go from mostly clear to partly cloudy. That's going to be the case as we go into tomorrow morning. And I think with the cloud cover tomorrow, that will tend to knock our temperatures down maybe just a couple degrees. By noon, we're looking at a mixture of sun and clouds. That trend continues into Monday night. Future cast trying to squeeze out a little bit of rain on Tuesday, but I think we will keep it dry. And then on Tuesday, that that powerful front I just showed you will be fizzling out to our west, maybe ringing out a few sprinkles into the mountains, but not a big deal. And as we look ahead, there's that front. It fades away as we go into Tuesday and into Wednesday. We have high pressure over the top of us, warming us up. And then there's another powerful cold front moving in through the plains. We still have high pressure over the top of us, some clouds on Thursday. And then that front starts to head our way as we go into Friday. I think it will increase some showers into the mountains Friday night and on Saturday. That's our next best chance of seeing some showers. And then behind that, temperatures do cool off. Looking at the tropics, here's a system off of North Carolina. Only a 10% chance of that developing and farther to the south into the Caribbean and 10% there near the Lesser Antilles and 20% farther out. But it looks like things are pretty quiet in the tropics right now, so no threat there. Tonight for the upstate, 61 year low, partly cloudy skies for the mountains, 56 for you, partly cloudy. Watch out for that fog in the morning hours and tomorrow. Maybe a couple degrees cooler than today. 77 and more and Cal Penn's Greer. You're checking in with 78 upper 70s from Hartwell to 96 and Liberty 77 into the mountains. 74 in Waynesville, a cooler 69 into Highlands and the Chiron line sky meter for tomorrow. I did put us at a seven, so a little lower because of some of those clouds out there. We go from 78 tomorrow Columbus Day to 81 Tuesday and then we warm to 80 on Thursday, partly cloudy skies. There's our rain chance by Saturday, about a 20% chance, not a big deal. And then much cooler Sunday and for the mountains, 74 for you tomorrow. Then warming through the 70s, close to 80 by the end of the week. Better rain chances for you Friday, especially into Saturday. Much cooler after that.